Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock Metal News with a Rock Metal News update. Marilyn Manson appears in Funny or Dies Halloween Anthology. Manson tells scary stories around the campfire. Check it out in the link in the description of this video. Billy Howardale of uh, Perfect Circle stated to Rollingstone.com about future recording plans. I hope to, but I know Maynard is in full tool mode right now. They're writing a new record and I have given him some songs that maybe he's going to look at, but I don't know how he does with juggling those things at the same time. I'd like to get uh, an, a Perfect Circle record underway, but I don't know. I'm just leaving it up to him and what his schedule allows. I'll be there when he's available. So cross your fingers that the tool album gets done and then they uh, do some uh, new a perfect circle the soundtrack for the new death clock titled metal Ocalypse, the doomstar requiem a clock opera is streaming for a limited time at yahoo.com you can listen to that in the link in the description and here's some bad news. Sepultura's North American tour with Unearth, Cataclysm, Dark Sermon, and Ancients has been cancelled because of visa issues. They hope to have the tour rescheduled in May. A statement released was... Due to a delay in the visa process, Sepultura have had to cancel their forthcoming tour, including their November 14th show at the Palladium. Attempts to make new arrangements for this time frame were not fruitful, and the camp has determined to reschedule the tour for May 2014. All tickets will be refunded. So stay tuned for more information on a new uh, tour. And The Ocean will lose two members at the, by the beginning of 2014. Guitarist Jonathan and Luke uh, Hess will be stepping down. So stay tuned for more information on that. And Taking Back Sunday are touring with ex Under Oath and now Sleepway vocalist Spencer Chamberlain. As he feels in for Adam, check out some fan film video of uh, two of the songs in the links in the description. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News. Thanks for tuning in.